Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Daisy. In today's tutorial, we're going to transform a Dollar Tree pizza pan into a beautiful farmhouse wall decor. For this project, we are mostly using Dollar Tree materials. We're going to need the pizza pan, jute or nautical rope, ribbon, any other material that you would like to use to customize it, permanent vinyl, transfer tape, and paint. We're going to start cleaning the pizza pan. To remove the glue, I like to use goo gone and clean it completely with a paper towel. Next, we're going to paint the pizza pan. I am using matte spray paint, but you may use liquid paint and paint it with a sponge brush. With the help of a hot glue gun, we're going to place the rope around the pizza pan. Now let's clean the permanent vinyl design previously cut on a Cricut machine. Now let's transfer the vinyl into the pizza pan. Or if you wish, you may apply the vinyl before placing the roof. I'm going to place a bow on top. This bow, I didn't buy it at the Dollar Tree. I made it with a piece of fabric that I had. On top, I'm going to place a succulent and some leaves. The succulent, you can buy it at the Dollar Tree. This farmhouse wall decor turned out gorgeous and you don't have to spend a lot of money. Now with the hot glue gun, we're going to place a hook on the back so we can hang it on the wall. 
I use a little piece of jute twine and a piece of fabric. As you can see, on this one we placed the permanent vinyl design on top of the pen. But there's another option. You may paint the design on the pen. Just cut the stencil on your Cricut machine, place it on top of the vinyl, and paint it with acrylic paint. It also is going to look beautiful. You can pick between those two options. I'm going to show you really quick how you can paint the design. And this is how it looks when you paint the design on top of the pizza pen. After that, you may decorate it using your personal touch. I am making a wall decor for my craft room. So I'm making three that says, dream, create, inspire. And I just love how it looks on my wall. I invite you to visit my website daisymultifacetica.com Also, you may visit me on my Instagram, Facebook, and Pinterest. Look for Daisy Multifacetica. I'm going to leave you those links in the video description. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like my video. Thank you for your visit and I'll see you in my next tutorial.